welcome to the Keenan Greyhound Stadium for 2024 running of the Callaway Pro-Am at Stud Race of Champions Final. 15,000 euro to the lucky winner. All six go to Traps this evening. The favourite, the worthy favourite is Trap 6 Dashing Toro, who will be hoping to add to his recent Lee Strand success in landing our big race tonight. We also have Bally Donahue GAA, who have brought a very large crowd here to the stadium for a benefit night this evening. Looking forward to a great night's entertainment and of course that big final race card. 15,000 euro to the lucky winner. Now the Greyhounds are on parade for race nine here at the Kingdom Greyhound Stadium. And of course, it is our feature race of the evening. In trap one is Extra Gain, owned by Susan Garrahy from Clonlara and trained by Jerry Hullion. Trap two is Ballymac Run, owned and trained by Liam Dowling from Ballymac Elegant. In trap three is Our Cracker, owned by J.E. and Tony Harvey from Hampshire in England, trained by Pat Buckley. Trap four is High Trend, owned by the RT and C Syndicate, trained by Graham Holland. Trap 5 is Kulavani Otto, owned by James and Nathan Corden from Nottingham in England. And in Trap 6 is Dashing Toro, owned and trained by the Twice a Day Everyday Syndicate. All in the heads running for the 2024 Callaway Pro Am at Stud Race of Champions final. In 1, Extra Gain, 2, Ballymac Run, 3, Hour Cracker, 4, Hyatt Trend, 5, Kulavani Otto, and 6, Dashing Toro. All important break coming up. And it's High Trend who pops out and leads them into the opening bend from Kulivani Otto, then the favourite Dashing Toro. Around the first bend they go in High Trend, leaving them into the second bend from Kulivani Otto. Dashing Toro has a chance in third, two, one and three have a bit to do at the halfway stage now. Trap four coming back to the field slightly as Kulivani Otto gives uh, pressure on the outside and takes up the running at the third bend now. Kulivani Otto goes on by two lengths on Dashing Toro, has a chance as he moves into second. The favourite's in second, but it's up front. Kulivani Otto who's going to take all the beating and wins the race down towards the second winning line. Five the winner from... Dashing Toro. Complete order finish for our ninth race, the Callaway Pro Am at Side Racer Champion Final. First trap five, Kulavani Otto. Second trap six, Dashing Toro. Third trap four, High Trend. The winning time was 29.38. Distance is one and a half and four and a half. Well done to James Corden and Pat Buckley's team. Great run by Kulavani Otto. 29.38 was a super run. High Trend in fairness popped out of the box. Uh, Kulavani Otto second and Dashing Toro who's the favourite was third but he showed great pace down the back and won by two lengths kind of going away from Dashing Toro who was a track record holder here last week but super run and he's a fantastic dog and it was a great final. Yeah it really was I had everything and look obviously you're, this is a local track for you uh, you're a Kerry man true and true and you have dogs yourself but it's special to see a great crowd here and Bally Donahue GAA have a benefit night here tonight it's great. Yeah, super night. As I was saying there during the week to Barry Drake, um, Jack Kennelly here will be a local trainer from Belly Dunahoe, and they had uh, 12 races carried here tonight with 1,000 euro to each winner. But lovely to see the big crowds back, and in fairness, even Sarah, it's you for coming down tonight. And I know it's great to see the Irish Greyhound industry getting behind stuff like this in local tracks. Three is a great track, to be fair, and a lot of dogs that ran here tonight, all six of them in the final. And other dogs here will probably be seen to want the bigger and better things. And this is your daughter, Fia. Will we get to see her maybe uh, getting into the train and rank sometime? Will you, Fia? Yeah. Do you love the dogs? Yeah. yeah. And who, which trap were you cheering for in the final? Um, the winner, trap five? Five, yeah. I'd say. Ah, it's great. great to see She was cheering for Liam Dowling's winning trap two, Bally Mac Run. Oh, very we all good. for on the carry dogs. Yeah, delighted. First thing I've ever won, so look, I'm a bit lost for words. I'm delighted. The first thing you ever won, and it's a big race like that. Two runs, 15,000. Brilliant prize money. Yeah, it's great prize money for two runs. Uh, you can't complain at all. Uh, he got knocked out of the derby the first round, so it was kind of the first thing on the mind was to come straight back for here. And look, he ran great tonight, so delighted. Yeah, and he had to dig deep. I mean, he took over High Trend, who won the laurels. That's an, uh, not an easy thing to do, but he's got serious pace, uh, Kulavani Otto. Yeah, it's not an easy thing to do, but look, Otto is kind of a 600-yard dog. He, he's very strong, and when he was only two lengths behind him, maybe, I kind of I kind of had an inkling that he might get him. So, look, delighted he actually went and done it, and he had the, the six dog in behind him who did the track record last week, so look, he had to get over the line, but he, he done it, so thank God. Yeah, and it was a brilliant... The race had everything, because Dashing Toro obviously done the track record here last week. He won the Lee Strand, but look, at every Everything went well for Otto. What's the target for him now? Uh, I know Pat's considering the Champions League in Shelburne. I'd probably go Dundalk. He might get in now after winning this the international one run for 20 grand, which is getting great prize money. So, <laughs> so uh, look, probably one of them options. And then I guess the Irish Derby is probably the long term. 
Yeah, well, that's November, well, sort of October now, so yeah. it gives you more options because the Derby's later this year, I suppose. Yeah, and the ledger's been moved forward in Limerick, which is our home track, so again, he might go for that. So, look, loads of options, but I think 550 is definitely his trip.